Hello it welcome to the uh, second episode of uh, Pokemon uh, Bug Gold Challenge on TV. Last time we begin our adventure, we defeat the first and the second gym leader and our rival twice. Yeah, the, fir uh, the first gym leader and our rival uh, and the second rival fight took a while, but eventually we beat them. And now that we beat all of them, now we can get a lot of variety of Pokemon. In fact, I will get five new team members. Yes, five new five no not five, four two new to new members. Elix Forest. Yeah, you remember? In order to get the HM cut, I need to uh, find out is to the far fetched. Behind him. That's one. Also, I grabbed my, the Ratata because I needed someone for a chip cut. It is one of my chip slave I will need. After I, I beat Morty, I probably go for for Chuck's gym, where I can get get in the sea. A tentacle for my as a water HM. Okay, where is it? Yeah, I know I need to get it behind, but I need to get to another place. Okay, let's see. Uh, yes, excellent. Like that. Uh, yeah, I remember. And gotcha. I'm both Pokemon only baby because I don't have badges. Blah blah blah, you find the far fetch. And we got the HMO1. Now we can cut this uh, little branch and it could go and make our way through. No, no, no. Okay, yeah, I want to have Pokemon, uh, the Pokemon I want. Uh, in order to get it, I need the TM for Headbutt, so I need to get it from that guy. Hope I can get it before I run out of Pels. Yeah, sometimes it looks on the big screen, sometimes it looks at the second screen. Yes, the headbutt guy. Hmm. Yeah, sure, let it to Yama. Well, I won't need force it anymore because I will get a lot of bug Pokemon. I'm only encounter a rival with this ghastly old multi with his bug Pokemon. What's that? Stuck. Okay, guys, I will see you once I find my Pokemon. Hey, guys, I'm back. We finally found a Heracross. Probably looked like two seconds, but actually, it took me almost an hour to find one. I had both the entire town to find. A hell class. Okay. Well, I can hear the hero class. I can probably get one. Uh, probably uh, can one shot him. Ah. Okay. Let's see. We have two great balls. Let's throw it on him. 
Are you serious? No! You can... Well guys, that suck. I want to switch Pokemon to Rattata because Rattata is, uh, even though it's low level, can do decent damage and Log is help a little bit. You're kidding me! Please, please! Oh, okay. We're still in the game, guys. Okay. okay Rattata is level 4, so I'm gonna use Rattata and Log is a. Uh, Oh, his HP a little bit. Oh. Okay, let's go for quick attack. Yeah, I don't care. Man, guys, that was very close. <laughs> Again, Herocrest is really rare. I check on uh, some website. It's probably gonna do a lot. Okay, let's go for another quick attack. I'm gonna care, by all means, use later. I'm just gonna keep the quick attack. And those only help him if you remain to all 1 HP. I okay, think that's gonna be handy. Okay, that should be enough. I'm not gonna waste another great balls. This level 3 is resist a lot. So I'm gonna run. And this Pokemon is really a pain. It inside. Free and damn it! Well, that suck. I hate this game. Seriously hate this game. Hold on. Well, I restart the game. Shame I don't have my name moves to put in the sifter or something like that. Okay, so he has Endure, Leer, and Horn attack. Okay, cut the... do more damage. <sighs> well, at least I know the spot where I can find the Heracross and it was near the Pokemon Center. I don't mind now. 
I'll just get, get more Pokeballs once we get here to the next town. There's a mall, we can get a lot of great balls and uh, good uh, Pokeballs. And there's a guy also offering. Okay, should I go for Sonic Boom? I don't know if you have more than 20 health. No. That suck. It's gonna take ages for me to capture him. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yeah. Need to take the risk and go for Sonic Boom. I reset the game. Pokeballs are pretty expensive when they have low money. Okay. Let's switch to Rattata. Oh, it's glitch HP ultimate and also buy a Pokeballs that are specific for bug and water Pokemon. Let's go for quick attack, lower his HP a little bit. Yeah, Heracross is a beast. That was a waste. Okay. Now let's try to capture him. He has low more low health than before. What's oh, called netball? It's, it's good against bug and water Pokemon, so let's hope the netball will do well. Come on, one, two, three. Yes! Finally! Oh, after... Whew. Man, that was worth it, yeah. Of course, it's gonna be mandatory for our team. Um... Should I give him a nickname? Hold on. Well, I decided not to give him a nickname. I think it's a good head as it is. Careful nature. Okay, let's see what nature is that. Careful nature, careful. More special defense and less special attack. Oh, that's perfect! That's his nature is perfect for Heracross. Man, we get a good Pokemon with good nature. A nature special attack is horrible, but you have an awesome physical attack. Now we have more boost for special attack. That's gonna help us very well against fire and psychic Pokemon. Even though we also bug and we strong against psychic. Yeah, I think the dark and the psychic elite four is gonna be easy. As well as well as Erika. Okay, guys. Uh, now we've got Heracross to our team. I'm gonna make our way to the Elix Forest, and basically, when something special is gonna happen. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna need to make my way to the, to uh, what's it called, National Park to get our three new, new members. It's gonna take a while. Well, I just figured out in order to get me my uh, three new team members, I need to do the bug catching contest. And I put Heracross on the daycare so he can get his own experience. Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturdays. Well, that's a shame. If I know that, I uh, will do the. Ah, oh, come on! You tell me I can get uh, my. Okay, hold on, hold on. Maybe I can get it in uh, adult places. Okay.
showcase. Yeah, just like a thought. Okay, I can get all three of them, but I can get one of them. I don't have to get to the natural park. I need to get and I can get from another route. Let's see. Okay, let's open. Let's see. No. Oh, what's it? I don't have thumb map. Well, that's stupid. Why I don't have thumb map? That's weird. I could see maybe in here I have. Aha! Uh -huh. Right. 30, 30, 30. Okay, I have. Okay, hold on. Ah, I get it now. You can get one and right for the free or is it? Aha, uh -huh, in here. Oh, that's gonna be only after more this gym. <sighs> well that's a shame. Thought I could get him uh, my old my old team new team uh, right away. That's disappointment. Okay, so I, there's a lot. <laughs> Man, so that's gonna be a problem. I won't be able to get my new team member until very late. Oh, we'll still get Heracross, and Heracross is good against the second, uh, the next gym because the next gym is a normal type of Heracross, it's a fighting type. And you can get a brick break at a very early level, I think 17 or 19. So I just, uh, just, uh, just got the bike. I'm, j I'm just gonna cycle back and forth till we reach a proper level, and then we're gonna uh, make it to the third gym. And then in here at uh, Route 43, I can get my next team members. And only on Tuesday I can get my two new new, uh, new members. And a last member only at uh, uh, Chuck's uh, uh, city, I think. Let's see. A last new member. Let's see where it is. Okay, there he is. I can get them from route. Okay. Okay, but I could get him from Kenwood City. Okay, let's see where it is. I think this checks. Yeah, in here. Here I could get my last two uh, new members. Here I could get my two. Uh, there's two members I could get here, but only on Tuesday. I could get to choose it uh, Thursday and Saturday, so I need to wait two days until we get there. Here I could get my new. Here is an, uh, one that I can get uh, in here, I don't have to wait till Tuesday. Two new members I can get only on Tuesday in the back catching cost and hopefully we'll, we'll get them because they're rare, very rare. And last new members in here, so I'm pretty sure we can get uh, the next two members before I can get them. Yeah, I still need to grind a little bit, so I'll see you once I'm finished with grinding and prepare myself for the third gym. Okay. <coughs> back and train a hero class to the proper level because at level 19 we remove brick break 75 brick. So 100 physical move so I'm pretty sure it will come in handy now it's time for the third gym third gym leader with me the normal type trainer some people say she's the toughest one and I'm totally agree <laughs> I think we have a little advantage that we have a female Heracross because she can use Attract. Ooh, K 
KO. Yeah, Heracross is a beast. Maybe we'll I get all my food. Maybe we we'll, maybe I'll food for a nickname, but that I have no idea what to call them. I have no idea. Just one left. You only have two Pokemon. Just one left. Okay. Ah, oh, nuts. Okay, we didn't flinch. How much it does? How much it does? Wow! Poor me. Yeah, poor you. Man, that is a ton! <laughs> okay, apparently she has two. Can I take her down now? Nope. Man, that was very quickly! More easy than I thought. You feel a little with me. Man, much easier than I expected. Ah, you mean it. Yeah, I need to go back to talk to this girl and now she's gonna give me the badge. Yeah, I'm on the badge. That's the, the plain badge to the third bat here in Jota region. Five more to go and eight more in Kanto. That's probably a tract. As I recall. Yeah. It is a lot of things I need to do, so I'm not sure what's in the next fight in the morning. There's a few things we need to do. Find Mordi, but first we need to find our rival. But first, I want to get my new team member, which is gonna take a while because the, it's a long road ahead. What do you want, Myra? Okay, sure. Okay, we need to talk to this woman. It's gonna give us the. Score battle. So we can uh, make the pseudo world go away. Okay, but there's nothing special with us, so. Hmm. What should I do first? Yeah, I think I'm gonna get my new team member because my new team member can learn a second move and that's really powerful against the uh, Ghost Gym because all this Pokemon is part poison. So I'll see what I get my new team member. Uh, change of plans. Uh, figure out I can get a an, an, uh, new Pokemon. Not that one, still. Oh, uh, there's a new Pokemon my mother wanted to add to her team. I didn't want that, but this Pokemon is also bug by also bug Pokemon, so I added them in case of uh, I won't get a uh, more new team member for our team. Uh, yeah. Okay, I have to be honest. The new team members is uh, going to be Venomoth, Scyther, Pinsir, and Shuckle. Uh, Scyther and Pinsir is going to be heavy healer, and I want to add them to our team. And Venema because I have a lot of moves, especially Sakit, and Sakit is really useful in this uh, generation. And so I'm gonna uh, decided to add them to our team and Shuckle because it's one of a, a hell of a tank in defense. So I need a, a one of our team. I get to use Panko as well because I need a, another pack of Pokemon in case I want to change my mind in the case of the right of Pokemon I want. I'm just gonna head by him, hope for Venom and Venonat. No, just a lot of photos. Yeah, I'm uh, out in the luck of rage. Didn't do more to the gym, I just want to add new members for our team. Come on, bring me Venonat. No, Panko. Okay, it's gonna take a while, hold on. 
Okay guys, I think I'll wrap uh, this episode for now because apparently my next team member is Venonet and the odds for getting him from, from uh, this area and headbutt is awful. I headbutt like a thousand times and I get all the, uh, the possible Pokemon except Venonet which is probably stupid because they didn't tell me which one is more uh, holy uh, to get but okay, there is a high chance to get Venonet in the night. So it's gonna take me in my country two more hours in order to get to the tonight. Then I can get Venonet. And yeah, I need to grind a little bit. I'm still thinking if I add the Panko to our team, he's incredible. He has a good attack and speed, but he has low, he has good attack and defense. He has low speed. His only weakness is fire. Maybe we should get him because I want to add Pinsir Scyther. Venonat and Shackle. Shackle, combined with Shackle and Fortress, is not so bad. The uh, Brick Ball. And uh, only the threat, the threat uh, that the Fortress is, is a Blaine Inspire Gym and Red's a Charizard. Let's Charizard, but that's it. Maybe I should add him to the team? Hmm. Okay, no, let's see right now. Let's see right now, let's see. Okay, Panko can learn rock moves, ground moves, dark moves, steel moves. Okay, and Pinsir. Of course, he has higher stats, but he has more weaknesses. Can learn ground move, rock move, bug move just like him. Fighting move. Hmm. But the fighting move is good against rock, steel. Rock, Steel, Ice, Dark, and Normal. Okay, we finished the Normal, so no one no, worried about that. R rock, st uh, rock is against Rock, Steel, Jasmine, Ice, Price, and Dark. But uh, all bug, uh, bugs is good against Dark as well, so don't need to worry about that. Maybe I should add a pincer to the team. Pincer is incredible. You have decent speed, good defense, incredible physical attack. And he has more high stat than Fortress. You have 35 uh, more uh, base stat than him. Fortress has, of course, have more defense. Little uh, less. Yeah, Fortress has 90 uh, attack and 140 physical attack. Resist Psychic, he resists Dragon, which is nice. Still thinking who shall I add to the team. Still rough. Really, really rough. Yeah, I'm usually confident and know which one I want to get, but when I'm getting my team members, it's just easy. Not that hard. No, there's no point in staying here and just uh, can go for the night. But the problem is we have no super effective against his game guard, so that's a problem. But the uh, ghost moves also frail in defense and health. Maybe I can brute force it with Heracross. Hmm. That's a tough one because Yanma is out of the after it's off the potato because it lit his foresight for for headbutt. So that means he can absolutely do no damage to him and unless I give him the U-turn. But Yanma is a special on the physical attack, so that'd be go to waste. Hmm. So what should I do? 
Well, guys, uh, so I need to uh, wait for the night until I get to the night. So I will see you the, uh, then until it's get, go for night time. I'm back. Did some grinding so Yalma can get uh, a lot of uh, different moves except for normal. So you learn Pursuit, which is a physical dark move. Our physical attack is horrible and even more horrible because of our nature, but it's try so effective against ghosts and has horrible defense and health, so it might become handy. And now, because he uh, reached level 33, our Yalma, he will evolve into a Yal Mega because he learned Ancient Power. Now, because I teach him Ancient Power, he will evolve. And so what? And Megan is evolving? Yes, he is evolving. Congratulations and mana evolved into your Mega. Awesome. Like I said, a little, uh, little bit of changes. <laughs> wow, we look huge. Okay, I put the uh, Panko in, in the Pokemon Daycare because I need him to uh, grab a few more levels. So now it's Panko on level 25, we become Fortress level 31. I need him to be Fortress because we have more uh, better stats. And uh, of course, I need to make sure he uh, always uh, remain the move back because this is the best physical moves for him. You can learn like uh, moves like Exesur or Mega Horn, of course, because he doesn't have any horn. Let's check his stats. Yeah, his attack is horrible. Look at that attack. It's special attack and speed. 83 special attack and 82 speed. That's awesome. Yeah, Hyrogress is with the same moves. I think I'm ready for a revel in the ghost gym. Maybe. Hmm. Now I'm gonna defeat the rest of the channel that didn't defeat, and I'll see you once I'm gonna fight our rival. Okay, trainer Pokemon, a uh, Yarma and Mount into Yan Mega. I decided to keep a Panko maybe for a proud team member because when I'm gonna do the bug contest, the Pinsir uh, Scyther are both rare and really hard to find. I hope I can find one of them. Look at both of them. Maybe I will switch Panko for one of the team members. We'll see. We'll see how Panko will, uh, will be in the rest of the adventure. I'm not uh, sure I'm gonna use him as a proud member of the team. And Mega has a few different moves. I uh, cut Venonat. And his, 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 uh, his ability is not bad. Nature is bashful, so neutral stats. I'm fine with that. His ability, just like he, uh, uh, the uh, pre evolves of the Omega, which uh, uh, boosts his accuracy. Uh, uh, boosts his accuracy, accuracy moves. Well, I say that like that. No, the Pokemon accuracy is boost. That, uh, things like. Take down is that accurate, so it increases to make it uh, hit more often. So we have confusion, so that's gonna be helpful against the Zubat and uh, the guest of my role will have. And basically, the Ghost Gym, because all these Pokemon is with the Psychic. And Mega uh, has the same moves, learn Edge Power. It's only 5 power points, but it's special, and, and we need special moves. 100 accuracy, 60 power, and it has 10% chance to increase all of our set in one stage, which is nice. Panko has Spike, I think I will keep it, uh, keep it because Spike is going to be very helpful. Mostly uh, for uh, a trainer that has 6 Pokemon, like the Champion, the Pokemon Trainer Red, uh, the Gym Little Blue. And Herokas, uh, I think still remain the same moves. Yeah, he learned Counter while we grind. Counter uh, basically the double the damage if we hit by a physical move. So that will be coming handy. I think Venonaut can handle the, the gym leader as a, uh, the gym leader by himself. So I'll see you once we go back to the Mordis gym. Okay, we are back at Aquatic City. Baron Tower. I'm pretty sure there's a uh, the Pokemon in here that's probably gonna fight us. I got the TM for Magnet for my guy. The, the South of Aquatic City, it's Chris Electric, and Miracle City, you know what it is. Claw, I'll give it to Venonet, might be coming handy because we don't have a high speed. And also, you didn't know, when Mega changed his ability, he's a Beetle Tindal, he's Tinned Lens, powered the non effective moves. 
I still don't get it. There are effective moves that will inflict the opponent, or not effective, uh, not very effective moves. I think if we got, uh, like, uh, for example, if we, he, he use quick attack on Onyx, that means it's gonna do more damage. I don't know if it's gonna become that handy. Only you know, for the special moves, they'll become nice. What's up? Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. No, I don't care. Okay. What's up? Oh, it's you. Let's be here to catch a legend. Pokemon game is something looks strong. It's only a dream. You see, there's a Pokemon suit for a trainer who has a uh, no sworn to become the strongest trainer. But the uh, Team Rocket's grants is just the right for you. Okay, let's uh, fight our Rebel Paul. Yeah, it's not to keep a uh, call of Marvel. I don't know why. Pretty sure we're gonna outspeed me. Whoa, Venomat is huge. Yeah, I train him uh, by the, uh, with the Daker, just run back and forth in my back. Okay, confusion. By all means, use Minlock. It's better than Curse. As long as it doesn't even curse, I'm fine with that. Okay, let's see how much it does. Nice. Ah! Come on, come on, hit! Benelant Heat Confusion! Benelant Heat Confusion! Yes! Gasly is down. Next is Kulava, okay. Time to switch to Yen Mega. Train, uh, train him to a Mega so we have super effective move against his Kulava. Man, he's huge. Look at that, his spine's on his back, I like it. Okay. Yeah, we're pretty over level. Pretty sure it's gonna crush him. Yeah, one shot. I train him all because Modi uh, has a game goal level 26. So I need to be prepared. Magnemite. Okay. Let's bring him across. Magnemite. Let's go for the brick break. What's fun this delay between my, my both and my my screens. Okay, let's see who's next. Venonat. Confusion. At level 27, man. Level 27, gonna learn Cybeam, which is real powerful. Yes! Eat yourself and. Ah, come on! Okay, let's see who's gonna hit. I have the. Uh, because I have a uh, very bad luck, I'm gonna hit myself and he's, he doesn't gonna hit his, himself. Let's see if, if he's gonna hit himself. See? Told you? Ah, oh, something with confusion. Nice. Okay, the Zubat is down. Goodbye, Zubat. Yeah. Our next rival fight. What's it? What else is gonna be our next rival fight? I think it's gonna be. Yeah, I think our rival, uh, next rival fight is gonna be very late. And only I think after we get the Modi's badge, Jasmine is chunk badge, when you need to go to the Team Rocket hit, uh, hideout. Okay. Go down. Let's cut the legendaries. Do you see it? Zubogan has braced with like a blue rocket from my hands. I have been chasing the Zubogan for almost 10 years but never been uh, this close. Okay, blah blah blah. We shall meet again. Eh, uh, no, probably not because we're not gonna chase weak and I did it once and I'm gonna do it again. It's a pain in the butt. So I'm not gonna ch uh, capture legendary Pokemon. They are OP. 
Okay, there's a lot of trainers in the gym, so I'll see you once I'm free to defeat all the trainers and I will be in front of the gym with them. Okay guys, it's time for the fourth gym in the morning. I defeated uh, most of the trainers, I got uh, the new move Psybeam, so that's become very handy. Okay! It goes Gym Leader Wardy. And he has four Pokemon. Pretty sure it's Ghastly. Yeah. One Ghastly, two Hunter, and one Gengar. Psybeam. Ah, yes! Quick Claw activate, they give him Quick Claw. It uh, increases the chance of me hit first. Let's see how much it does. It's... Don't paralyze, don't paralyze! Okay, we're fine. Okay, that was a stupid mistake. You shouldn't go for high propulsion. That was a waste token. Ah! Come on! Nuts. That's gonna decrease my side beam by how much? Four! That's a lot. Okay, guys, he's down. That's one down, free to go. Hunter. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it up. Nuts. That means we'll have to switch. I hope the Cybeam will take Hunter down. Yeah. Ah, are you kidding me? That's crap. Yeah, that's brand new mega. That's absolutely stupid. Ah! Oh hell no. Where is my waken? I was prepared for that. Wake up. Probably go for Dream Eater. Expected. Well, well, I'm pretty fast. Goodbye. Gengar. Uh, I think we're gonna survive a uh, Shadow Ball. I'm not sure. We'll see. Maybe you'll survive. Come back, Venonet. See how much it does? Ouch! And <laughs> decrease my special defense. How much side beam does? Nothing. Yeah, I need to switch. <laughs> Shoot, that did a lot. I'm pretty sure in Mega can survive that! Shoot, that did a lot more than expected. Okay, that's physical. Please do a massive damage. Massive damage! Okay, that was fine. Nuts, he has a berry. Whew, he survived. Okay, let's go for the ancient power. We have a high special attack. Ah! No! I don't have... No, 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 that's not good. I'm out of Awakening. And pretty sure he has... What's his move? Sucker Punch, Shadow Ball, Hypnosis. Ah, and Miluk, he doesn't have Dream, you know. Okay, we're fine. We we'll only need to wake up. Yeah, doesn't have Dream... This Gengar doesn't have Dream, you know. So can heal his... So all he need is to wake up. That's that did a lot. I don't know why you have much potion. I don't know where I get from where I get that. Yeah, a bug uh, stuck to take heavy damage, even though I'm fully evolved. Okay, we can survive that now. Let's go for pursuit. No, wake up!
Okay, it's now whatever. Please wake up. Woo! And we woke up at the last moment. Okay, that was too dangerous. <laughs> okay, we're back in the game. Next is Hunter. Nuts. <laughs> Look at our, our health of the Pokemon. Uh, yeah, it's been terrible. You're probably thinking, yeah, fighting doesn't affect ghosts, but we have flying moves. What is gonna say? No, it's not over yet. I still believe we can do it. Yeah, so am I. Okay, look. This move can, can be effective on the ghost, but Aerialist does. Nice. Okay, how much it does? 23 damage because of this level. Okay, it's physical. Please do a massive damage. And... KILL! A crit! Nice! Get out of here! Oh, that was a close one. Gengar is dangerous. With that, it fit Jim in the body. Blah, blah, blah. That we received the four badge. This is the four badge here the Jotun region. Four more to go. Three shots with Gimme Team Shadow Ball. But the, the episode is not over yet. There's one more thing we need to do before we finish this episode. And, get, and that's to get the HM to surf. First, let's go back to the Pokemon Center because I wanted to do that first. Place. Hey, hey! Stop that this is uh, uh, such a uh, serious dance. Show me something uh, like cooler dance. You must be push a request on me. Huh? Are you telling me you won't respect what customers want? Oh, well, then I will show you how to dance. I wish you a great one. Oh, sorry, that's the grand say, not the kimono girl. Who are you? How dare you get in my way? Look who's talking! I'm gonna show you! You, what you got? One Pokemon and a coffin. Bad move. Level 12? Is that a joke? Okay. We just fought Modi with this 26 Gengar. He has level 12 coffin. Yeah, this game has some problems. Embarrassed, dude. Really embarrassed. Looks like I lost. Yeah, no shit. Get lost. Blah blah blah. HM of free. That's the HM for surf. Now we can go for Chuck's gym. Later we'll go to the Pokemon Tower, a Pokemon in the Light Tower, or something like that. So I can talk to Jasmine, so I can challenge her gym as well. So yeah, this guy, this is it for the episode. Next episode we're gonna fight ja Chuck and Jasmine, maybe even a uh, Price as well. Because I think I can do three gyms in a row. And we continue my adventure from there. So, then, then, subscribe and catch up in the next episode. Goodbye.